also just want to give you a heads up on something that I learned today. So I have my natural gas stove top. Uh, to use this, you have to have a natural gas conversion kit, uh, which they sell at Home Depot and probably a bunch of oil RV outlets and things like that, to allow it to run off of a propane tank. So that's what this guy is. Comes with all these goodies in here. And that's going to get uh, attached to the gas inlet here, run down to our tank underneath, and we should be good to go from there. But I just wanted to give you a quick heads up what's going on. And if you didn't know that, hopefully that's helpful. Okay, so after a lot of uh, unnecessary attempts to make this stovetop work, uh, pretty much all I needed was a regulator on the propane tank and then um, that's adjustable. Had to find the right pressure and then this guy works happy, uh, happy as can be. So all uh, you have to do to operate it, pop down here, go in here and you've got your knob on the top of the propane tank. Open that guy up. And then uh, you pretty much should be good to go. You have to hold it for a second to let it light. There we go. And just like that, we've got fire. Nice, uh, this one's like a 3300 BTU. And that one's like a th uh, thousand or something, I don't remember. But they're real hot, so they should do the trick for sure. And it looks real nice. And as you can see, they are anchored into just with these um, corner pieces. So if you ever have to take them off and get underneath there for any reason, just three screws to get it off. But it's also in there too. Pretty, pretty strong, so it's not going anywhere. So our kitchen is finally coming together. Pretty much done, which is super exciting because that was way harder than it needed to be, I think. Um, I probably should have done some more reading before I tried just installing. But now that that's done and I did do the reading after the fact, it's good to go.